actor Kevin Spacey has been found not guilty on the charges against him in a London court this morning. He was facing several counts of sexual assault and other related charges. CBS News reporter Haley Ott is following this from London for us. Haley, good morning. It's good to see you. Um, what more can you tell us? Good morning, Anne-Marie. Yes, Kevin Spacey was facing nine charges relating to different types of sexual offenses. Seven of those were for sexual assault. Two were more serious crimes. And as you said, he's been found not guilty on all charges. What's interesting is potentially the consequences could have been really serious for Spacey if he'd been found guilty of some of these charges. Two of them had very severe sentences potentially associated with them all, one had a life sentence, which in the UK is 25 years. So this is a big, a big deal that Spacey has been found not guilty on everything. And so, you know, what does this mean for, for Spacey? Is this sort of the end of any courtroom wrangling he'll have to deal with? Well, this trial's been going on for a few weeks in the UK. It was a criminal trial, um, and Spacey's been showing up to court every day. He's been here technically on bail. So now that he's been found not guilty, that's done. He's he's free to go. Um, how big of a deal was this? Was this a particularly high profile trial? We, I, I don't think we got a ton of coverage on this side of the pond. Yeah, I think that's because it's been going on for a long time. And sometimes the UK judicial system can feel a bit impenetrable when you're far away. Um, but this is a big deal. Kevin Spacey, A, he's a Hollywood actor, so he's very famous. But B, he's a huge figure in the United Kingdom. He uh, was a big part of theater here. He was the head of a really prominent theater for a very long time. And nine counts of sexual assault for anybody who was such a major cultural figure is a very significant uh, thing. And so this trial has been watched very closely by the media here. And the result is significant also for Spacey himself, who previously has said that if he was cleared of all charges, he would try to relaunch his acting career, which has obviously been waylaid by these accusations. Right. And not just these ones, but the previous ones here in the U.S., um, you know, we saw the collapse of, well, the we thought was going to be collapse of a very successful show that he had been on. The show went went on, but um, but we haven't heard much from him since. Has he been speaking at all in the UK? He's been appearing in court, and he's mm. given really emotional testimony, which obviously you can't see unless you're a journalist covering the trial. There are very specific rules about covering these sorts of trials here in the UK. For example, we're not allowed to name any of the complainants because they're entitled to anonymity for their entire lives. And it's, but Spacey has given very emotional testimony. This has clearly been very significant in his life. And the te all the testimony in the trial was very emotional. So mm -hmm. it'll be interesting to see what his next moves are because as you said, this is this really, he was he was fired from a really big show in the U.S. He was a very significant and famous and successful actor before all of these allegations were made. So uh, it'll be interesting to see what happens next for him. And just a reminder, in terms of the case that happened in Massachusetts, uh, the criminal charges were dropped in, in that case as well. But uh, the cloud has certainly been hanging over uh, Kevin Spacey as we anticipated the outcome of the case here in, in the UK. Uh, Haley Ott, thank you very much.